Hey, I'm so excited to tell you about this new microscope. So I have been on the lookout for a good microscope for my home use, but I specifically wanted to get one that I knew would be possible for general practitioners to afford. Because here's the thing, as a pathologist, we can use the fanciest of microscopes, but you do not need a $30,000 microscope like a lot of pathologists have in your clinic to do good evaluations on your cytology. You do wanna get a good quality microscope, really dabbling in that like 100 to $500 range doesn't oftentimes get you like enough quality, but there's some really great mid-range microscopes out there that are affordable for the clinic and that are excellent quality. And so I really wanted to try out a couple of different kinds, see if there were any newer ones on the market that um, I could test out and potentially use for myself, but then also recommend to you guys. And I found one. So my friends at Microscope Central hooked me up with this AccuScope 3000 LED series and I love it. Honestly, I was a little apprehensive at first. I thought, mm, I don't know, is this gonna be a good microscope? It's so affordable that you just kind of wonder if it's gonna be quality. And let me tell you, it is, it's really good. So I would definitely recommend it for your clinic if you're in a general practice or emergency clinic or even specialty clinic. Like it's an excellent microscope for all those uses. I'm gonna be using it to evaluate cytology in my house. So, I mean, if it's good enough for me and you know, I, I'm happy using it, then I hope that you like it too. All right, let me tell you about some of the things that I like about this microscope. Okay, so first of all, it's just a good looking microscope, which it just feels quality. And I think that's important. It doesn't feel like a toy microscope because it's not. It has a nice narrow footprint, so it doesn't take up a ton of room on your counter, which is really important in the clinic. There's a lot of stuff on our counters. All the basics are here, so we've got obviously coarse and fine focus and the knobs feel really good to your hand. They're not just flinging around like sometimes the cheaper microscopes do. The ergonomics of the microscope are great. So we can adjust these eye pieces. We've got these eye cushions, eyepiece cushions that feel really good under your face. The objectives that I have are 10X, 20X, 40X, and 100X. I would suggest getting the plan objectives what plan does is basically it helps eliminate that annoying blurriness that can occur around the edges of your field. That's so obnoxious to me because you're basically losing like 50% of your field when it's blurry all the way around. So that plan objective can really help. It, I think they are a little bit more expensive, the plan objectives, but 100% worth it, really. I would not recommend it if it wasn't worth it. It does help a ton. And I would also recommend getting the trinocular version that allows you to attach a camera. And even if you don't plan to use a camera right now, you may at one point want to use a camera and you wanna have that ability. Without it being trinocular, you won't be able to use a camera. And now in the day where we're sharing images and we're sharing cases and submitting, you know, even sometimes uh, cytology photos for help, we wanna have that ability to take pictures with a camera. Also being able to show your clients, you know, what you're seeing if, if they can Sometimes they can come back and see what's on your, you know, on your camera if you have one that has a screen. This one right here, this is actually from Microvisioneer. Um, they are uh, friends of mine as well as Microscope Central. And they have this awesome system where you can digitize your slides and share those with anybody. And it creates like this really cool digital scan that's super easy to share. So if you're interested in that and, and, um, and hook it up with Microvision here, let me know. But really my system is made to be able to do both. So I have I have this camera attached up here. But either way, regardless of the camera that you get, definitely highly recommend the trinocular. And then most importantly, what you see under your microscope through the ocular looks great. The fields are sharp. The cells look good. There's no blurriness. Oh, hello, histoplasma. <laughs> this is a case of a cat that had some draining skin lesions and you can see a little histoplasma yeast there inside the macrophage. So diagnosis made. Thank you, microscope. But doesn't that look good? I just love this. So good.